looking at this epoxy it is $3.49 which I think is a good price it's Harbor Freight Tools brand um, you know that an epoxy setting like this is going to cost you a little bit more so I think that that's a great deal then they have wood glue this is $3.99 for this wood glue. I think that that's probably a good price compared to Gorilla. It wouldn't be a bad thing to give that a try and see how that is. Here is a nut and bolt assortment. This is $16.99. And anytime you're working on any kind of little projects, you have your own little um, nuts and things here that you don't have to look for and there's a nice little case that this comes in so for $16.99 I think that that's a good price there's a $2.99 funnel tray so I think that that's good also I got a good selection of brushes here can't really see the prices there that's $2.99 and that's a 10 piece that's $1.99 and that's a 10 piece. They've got some a four piece set for $1.99 and a really nice set for $4.99. Got lots of gloves. There are some craft projects that I have done that I wish I had some gloves before I started. They've got a lot of these for $1.99. There's two pairs in here and they've got the different sizes. That's a good price on that. I have got a tool, a glue gun that's that's battery operated. Um, it would be $5.99 for this charger. I think that's a good price for a battery charger. And they've got several, of course, packs of rechargeable batteries beneath that. So that's a good option to look at. They've got some, a 12 pack of Terry towels for $7.99. Sometimes it's good to have your own stack of towels for cleanup. I think that that's a great price. If you're like me, you're always redoing your craft room. They've got some magic movers for $3.99. So some of those heavy tables and equipment you can move easily by just taking a little bit off and then just using the magic movers for $3.99. That's a good price. They've got plenty of storage back here. There's a 40 bin organizer for $14.99. I don't know if you can really get a look and tell that. Here's a nice storage case. These are $4.49 for all those little small pieces. They've got some stacking bins for $3.99. Got some bigger racks here. These will be nice to put in a drawer. This is a very nice bin. Some of those cheaper bins, you open them up and everything spills out. I think something like this would ensure that that wouldn't happen. And this one is I like this one myself. 
for a lot of those little ones little pieces they've got some nice heavy duty carts here And they've got some options if you're going to craft fairs. They've got some options here for little hand trucks. Now, I like this one myself because you can fold this up and slide it under somewhere. So, that'll be neat. If you're like me and you've got a standing craft desk, I stand at sometimes. They've got um, four piece anti-fatigue foam mats they've got a set here and that's $8.99 and they've even got a mat for $9.99 they've got some cheap options for some sanders here I've kind of been thinking about getting one There's always a project or two that I think about doing. Sanding down some wood and redoing it. And I wouldn't want to pay that much for it. So here's some good options. I recall that one time when I lost one of my husband's drill bits. He normally doesn't get on to me about that, but it would be nice to have my own drill bit sets. They have some nice prices here to have your own little collection for projects. They have a little bit of everything in here. Some things that I wouldn't expect. A cutting board, a scale, Dutch oven, clipper set. I've got this sewing quick stitch here. They've got this five in one hobby wood burner kit that's eight ninety seven. And they've got a electric engraver also. I don't know how steady a hand I would have, but that's interesting also. I know there's been a lot of crafts with these mugs. This says compared to Yeti at $24.99, these are 20 ounces and they're $6.99. This store seems to be out of rulers, but they have some of the long types of rulers here. We've got a lot of options for utility blades. Okay, so I was looking in the ad and I see the magnetic tool holder. It reminds me of the tool holders that they have at Ikea. And since I've never lived any less than three hours or more from an Ikea, this is a great deal because they sell them for $4.99 here in store. I don't know if you can see that, but I have a coupon here for $3.99. So I think I'm going to pick up two of these and see what I can do so it is the next day and I did happen to pick up two of those magnetic holder bars like I said they were $4.99 in store and I used that coupon that was in the ad and she just scanned them and they came up $3.99 the system automatically changed them so I've gotten those were $3.99, but like I said, there are some nice things 
um, that can be used in the craft room over at Harbor Freight. So pay attention to those little ads that come. And then they also have coupons and free gifts when you come in. And um, I happen to pick the batteries since I never can get enough batteries, whether they're Dollar Tree batteries or drawer cell batteries. Batteries are uh, batteries. They can never get enough of them. And so I ended up getting this pack of batteries for free just for my purchase. And like I said, I ended up buying those two and I only paid $7.98 before tax. So that was my um, little journey at Harbor Freight and I hope you enjoyed this little tour and was able to find something. See you later Crafty Nistas. Update. <clears throat> I just wanted to share that if you like those magnetic holders that I picked up, I found an ad in store for Friday through Sunday, April the 12th through 14th. They're going to have those for $1.99. That's okay for me. Like I said, I know that I'll find other bargains and then I'll be back. But I just wanted to share that those are going to be down even more $1.99.